Hello everybody and welcome to another first look. Um, I'm gonna do more of these just because I like to look at new games and I know people out there like when people look at new games because I like when people look at new games. I feel like a lot of the YouTube that I'm watching nowadays is just new games. You know, first looks of games, how people like the game and different mechanics of the game. This one's called Beer Factory. Um, so we're just going to go ahead and jump into it. Um, you know, it's it's Beer Factory. Um, from my understanding, you know, a lot of the game is getting your Beer Factory ready to go, um, getting some of the stuff inside taken care of, and then actually, uh, I believe you do brew some beer or at least do something in the process um, during this demo. So it is just a, a prologue, just a demo. Um, I've been watching some of the dev stuff on it. It seems that the game could be coming out very soon. Um, you know, the the dev team on this said that they were kind of just finishing up the last portion of the game, so that's exciting. Um, that means that we could be we could be in for this game very very soon. That is super loud. So let's go ahead and see what he's got. Okay. Okay, we gotta get the. Get the electricity back on. Alright. Oh, okay, so this... So yeah, you get, you get kind of your factory up and running here. Squatted in. Alright. Let's see what's going on here. So this is our factory, I suppose. Let's open the barrier and go in. Let's see, open the factory office door. Okay. All right. And I don't see anybody squatting in here. I'm gonna quickly just go ahead and do something here with my controls. Oh, let's make some coffee. For one dollar. Because why not? You buy a factory, you make coffee. That's just kind of the first thing you do. Make some coffee. And let's drink the coffee. I think you have an energy base in this game. So like if you run out of energy, one of the ways you can get energy back is by making coffee. Uh, and now let's go take a look at the fuses. Just jump through the window there. Alright. I don't want, he said it was squatted in, so I don't want anyone to jump out at us. What's going on with the fuse box? Okay. Find and grab the fuse. Alright. There's the fuse, just conveniently sitting here, because why wouldn't it be? Don't you love that? It's just right where it needs to be. And let's put the fuse where it needs to be and turn it on. Oh boy. This is a squad. <laughs> what is this? What are we supposed to do? Chase the bum and throw objects at him? What? Okay. Let's throw something at him. <laughs> what? Bro just did a backflip. What is this game? Oh. Does he have smoke bombs? What is happening? This is, I, I'm going to be honest with you, this is not how I expected this game to start. Not at all. We just got to throw trash bags at a bum to get him to go away. <laughs> what is this? Pimp my forklift to receive a tuning part propane. <laughs> okay. What is happening? You all right, man? Look at that haircut. What's up, big haircut? Wow. Okay. And what is this? Oh, a fork? Oh, we get to assemble the fork on the forklift. Okay. Picking up the pieces. I just throw it on there. Okay. Let's go find the second fork. There it is in the corner. Pick it up. And we will run back out there. And I just stepped in something gooey. That's gross. And we'll throw that, quite literally throw it on there. And we'll open the factory doors from, of course, the inside. 
Why wouldn't it be in the inside? All right. Sweet. We got access to the factory. Now the big doors are open. Take garbage and throw it in the bin. All right. Well, we can grab this bag that we made. Throw that in there. And room upgrade available. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. So in the top right, there's a counter for how many bags we have to oops, collect and throw in there. Let's go get that mop. So apparently we have a mop. It might be might help us clean up that gooey thing that I stepped in earlier. Okay, we got the mop. Perfect. Let's clean this puppy up. Get it nice and clean. All right, so where's the mop? There it is. All right, let's see. What do we got? Oh, gross. All right. Interesting mechanic. On the backstroke, you don't clean anything up. Only on the front. Seems strange, but whatever. All right. And can we clean this up? No. Of course not. And we clean, we can clean this up, I bet. Yep. It's an interesting dynamic of how that works. I'm not really sure how I feel about that. Can we put this down now? Okay. Now we need, what do we need? Buy a tool desk. Okay. Buy a tool desk. Great. So it's hard. We have a tool desk. Interesting. And equip yourself with the new toolbox. Use the toolbox to screw all the bolts. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. Oh, interesting. So if you go down with the bolt, it will screw it in in one. But if you lose track of it with your mouse. Interesting. Okay. Screw all these down then, I guess. I think, I don't know what we're building here. Okay, and I'm missing one. There it is. It's interesting how they put you against the wall. Okay, and find the first support. Is this, I'm assuming this is the support. And assemble it, and we're just going to throw it on. <laughs> yeah, because that, that would be that simple. All right, and throw it from all the way back. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's not legit. Okay. Oh, wow. There's a lot of, st oh, geez, a lot of storage space here. All right, let's keep doing trash. Did I make it? <laughs> oh, you get points for throwing things. All right. It's kind of cool. Pimp my forklift. A new tuning part. Okay. Um, let's see. Well, I can clean. Okay, here we go. Some more. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't make it. All right, we'll grab this one, too, while we're here. That didn't make it either. I was on a roll there for a second. Okay, there's one, two, oh. New factory extension available. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right, some investors. Um, let's keep, let's go ahead and buy the extension, I guess. We'll clean up in here also. 
clean up the mess. Squatting mess. Let's see. So we want to... Here we go. This should be... Yeah, we have enough. Go ahead and brush that. And unlock the green crusher. Oh, we need to do that from the computer. Industrial machinery. Oh, okay. Green crusher. All right. There you go. We have a green crusher now. Interesting. So I don't know. It must be to process the stuff that you need to make the beer. I don't know how far they've gone in this. Um, except contracts. Let's clean up first. I'm gonna I'm gonna get all the cleaning done first, and then um, which I won't make you sit through because it's gonna be a lot. And then I'll uh, I'll come back after after that's done. Okay, so I started walking slow, and I couldn't really figure out why that was happening. But I think it's because I'm out of coffee. So we're going to go ahead and give coffee a shot and see if I can start running again. Because that was just painful, um, walking so slow. And that, that actually seems to be it. I feel like I'm walking a little faster, so... That was it. So you do need to make sure that you are filling yourself up with, um, with energy. Because now, now I can run... Um, so yeah, just got a couple more things to clean up here and then we'll get we'll get back to the the process at hand here. All right, and here's the last bag of trash that we were looking for. Buckets. All right, let's go accept a contract. And see what's next on our list here. Contracts. What is this? Refine 25 sacks of raw malt grain. Okay, yeah, so you gotta um, create the resources in order to order one pallet of raw malt sack. Okay? So you have to create the resources in order to get the product, it looks like. Let's go ahead and where would I find the product? Ah, there it is. Okay, delivery. We want raw malt grain. How much is a pallet? Do we know? Probably 10. It says add 10. So let's add 10. Let's see if that's a pallet. Actually, how many do we need for that contract? Wasn't it like 25? Uh, okay, so this is going to be $400. So we'll actually just order that, see what's next. Open the back door of the truck to unload it. Oh, is it already here? Oh, here it comes. Oh wait, can we use the forklift? Isn't that what it's for? Oh, okay, so F to turn on the forklift. And it looks like... The horn has a horn. All right, let's turn it off and get off. How do I get off? C, exit the vehicle. Okay. I'm going to open up the truck door here. Oh, yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab our grain here. And how does this work? So E and Q... Looks like we'll open up or raise up our fork to a good level and we can drive it in. Ooh, that's a little finicky. Drive it in. Okay, three green and R to lock it in. Oh, okay. I see. Go ahead and back up. And the doors close by themselves. We'll bring this inside and he's just going to peace out all on his own. All right. Interesting. Well, let's take this in here at a very slow rate into our shop. And that looks like a spot for pallet, so let's go place it down over there. Because why not? It looks looks logical. 
I mean, right next to the conveyor belt that we're probably going to have to use. So, and we will unhook and back up. Okay. And let's see. So we had to turn on the new grain generator or grain crusher. Okay. Power on the grain crusher. Grab resource sack from pallet. Okay. Grab from the pallet and clean the dirt under the grain crusher. Oh, okay. So it'll give us some. I'll throw that over there for now. It's gonna give us some new stuff. Interesting. One one bag of malt. What do we have over here? Inverse, so we can change the direction. Speed. Oh, we can turn the speed up. Oh yeah. Interesting. Okay. Can we see it go in? It might have already gone in. Let's see. What does this say? Waiting process. Right. Well, we know we have to get the rest of them in there, so why don't we just put them all in while we're here? Can I set them down? I don't really want to throw them down. Oh, I can just drop them. Okay. Oh boy. There we go. Let's gently place them down. How about that? Instead of throwing them. Let go. There we go. Getting these guys on here. In an orderly fashion. What do we got going here? Weeding process, refine one. What is this? What does this do? Refine grain. Oh, okay. So I have to actually turn it on. Or manually do. Oh, okay. Here it comes. The crushed malt grain. All right. Interesting. Well, we had 10 bags. So there's two, four. This will be five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay. Now what do we do with them? Export the first product. Do this place your pallet full of resources. Oh, can we just pick this up? Oh, we can. Okay, cool. We'll just put this down. And how does this work? Oh, you just throw them on the pallet. All right, get these loaded on here. I just flung one into the next dimension. There's 10 here. We need more. What do we need? 25. So it doesn't look like there's any more costs associated with it. So can we uh, can we get more? Do this place your pallet full of resources in the bed of the... Oh, the pickup truck. Okay. All right. Well, um, let's do that. Turn this off for now. I think. Oh, yeah. Over here. Turn that off. Nope. It's on forever. Okay. That's okay. Let's go ahead and drive the forklift. Apparently, when you get on the forklift, you lose all sound from the machine. And line these forks up and drive straight in. I'm gonna adjust myself here. Bear with me. I haven't driven a forklift in a minute. I'll lift that up. And we'll. Bring it back over to where the pickup truck is, I guess, and we'll throw it on the pickup truck. Damn, this thing goes slow. But I guess in a warehouse like this, I wouldn't, I wouldn't expect anything else. Oh, all right, it just snaps down. Now we gotta complete the contract. Okay, so we gotta go I'll leave this out here, actually. In a terrible spot, but that's okay. Because we actually need to go make more coffee and buy some more material. 
we need 15 more bags of grain. We have just enough money to do that, so let's get that. Drink this coffee so we have some movement speed. And here comes our truck with our next pallet of grain. Yeah, yeah, I know you're here. I can see you. Open this puppy up. Cool. In the forks up. Is there a... What's the first person mode look like? Oh. There's like a... A fork... View. So you can see kind of what you're doing in the front. That's interesting. God! Okay. That was... Strange. Oh! Yikes. I'm gonna break the game. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh... Get this stuff processed, and, um... We'll, uh, we'll come back after it's processed. It's kind of the same process. You're gonna... You know, put the pallet down, run it through the machine. I wonder if I run it all... If I put all of these in here, though. Because I feel like if it just drops on the pallet... I wonder if... Because there's a pallet spot over there. I wonder if I can just put a pallet... Like... Hold on, let's try this here. So if I... Just put these on here... Delicately spaced. I don't know if there's a max of these I can put in here. I can't imagine there would be. Oh! Be careful. Let's get all of these in. And then I want to try to put the pallet over there in that um, spot. Because if they're just going to fall out and onto the pallet, I wonder if it'll automatically put them on the pallet. Let's see, this is the last one. And if I just... I can just pick this up. If I just put this here on the ground so that they come off the pallet or come off the belt and go right onto the pallet. Does that work? Let's pull some of these bags out. I wish there was a better... Oh, I guess I can do it that way. So if I drop these down... Oh yeah, see? They snap, they snap down onto the pallet. Okay, that's cool. That's so much easier. So I can just do it this way. And then pick up the pallet and bring it outside. So I wonder if you get like an excess of pallets or if it's worth ordering so you have multiple pallets so that you can have one over there and then once this one's full you can switch it out and bring it to the truck on like bigger loads and stuff. It's kind of a neat game, I'm not gonna lie. It's different, it's time consuming, it's kind of right up my alley if you've been watching any of my videos anywhere. Um, you see that, like, the games that I like to play are kind of tedious. Like, don't give me a game that I'm going to master in seconds. What was that? What is... Oh, this guy. <laughs> He's back for more. Okay. Well, good thing we have a trash bag right here, I guess. Do I just gotta beat him up again? Oh, he dodged it. What the? Yeah, I just, I'm just, you just beat up a homeless guy in this game. What? Bro has smoke bombs. What? He just did a backflip. What is this guy on? 
<laughs> what is happening? What is this guy, Francis? All right, Francis. Why don't you get off the goop for real? I get money? Beat up a homeless guy, you get money in this game, apparently. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's that's probably the, the best part about this game, to be honest with you. What a strange concept. What a strange, strange thing. All right, let's put our forks down. Load this guy up. I am clearly need to learn how to drive a forklift. Okay. Go straight in. You know why? Because I'm so used to, um, in games, I'm sure more people can relate. When you let go of the wheel, or the button controlling the wheel, you would expect it to snap back. Um, in like arcadey games like this. And that's not the case. They've actually done the wheels correctly, so when you when you let go, it your wheel will stay turned. Alright, let's drop that down. And that should be our first contract completed. I wonder if we have to go inside and complete it on the computer maybe. Uh, contracts. Validate. Okay. All right. We got we got thirteen hundred bucks. Thirty three rep points, and we get another contract in, and we get employees. Employees now. Derek Johnson. Seven point five an hour. He. What does he do? I, I, maybe I. Can they just put him wherever I want? We'll hire him. And uh, see what that does. Port 50 crush. Okay, well, um, we're going to stop it here. Uh, it's kind of just, you know, first look. We'll make it really quick. Here's this guy. What What is this guy? Uh, cleaner. All right. So we can put him on cleaning, I guess. What is... We'll, we'll buy the next tier. Oh, grain worker. Okay. So he's going to do grain. Maybe. Manage employee. Yeah, green. Okay, cool. So they allow you to hire employees and then um, do different stuff around the, the warehouse for you. Um, all right. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Let's just do a quick first look. Um, I may do a part two to this just so we can see kind of where the, where the demo takes us. I don't know what they have in the demo. I don't know what other options are available or different types of jobs are available and how far they've gone with it. But um, if you want me to do a part two, leave it in the comments um, and let me know. I don't mind doing a part two. Um, it's kind of an interesting game, so um, I'll make sure that I can save my progress and uh, we will do that if, uh, if anyone wants to. And if there's any other games that you'd like a first look of, um, you know, within within a, a decent price range, let me know and I will uh, see what I can do. Worst case, I can just return them after, you know, before the two hour threshold. But uh, let me know in the comments if there's any other games you want me to review and uh, if you want me to do a part two of this and we will see you next time.